Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome to the hammer part of my Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate Tutorial. Right, so, jumping straight into the basic moves here. Now if you press X, that does a vertical smash. And if you press X three times, this does your basic bread and butter combo. You basically smash down twice and you do a third kind of golf swing. Now that golf swing does the most damage and that is the move that you want to connect. Um, so obviously when you're sort of timing or you're attacking enemies, make sure you can kind of you've got enough time so you can try and land that one because that's the one that does the most damage. Um, adding to that, if you press A you do a kind of horizontal smash and that is used for knocking out enemies so if you get a chance um, that's also really good. Having said that your golf swing can also daze and knock out enemies as well. Um, then if you hold down R you basically charge your hammer and then when you let it go if you're standing still it will do a powerful smash however if you're charging it and you run and you let go then you basically do this kind of tornado spinning move now this move here is a move you do not want to use it's not if you're going to charge your hammer then you want to run up to the enemy stand still and get the powerful smash instead because that spinning move leaves you really really open and compared to the other move it doesn't actually do as much damage it might look impressive but it really isn't worth it especially when you're fighting some of the stronger monsters later and you just really can't afford to be left open for that long so where possible try and avoid using that um, again with this weapon you want to adopt the kind of hit and run strategy you do with the greatsword in that you don't really want to run with your hammer out so if you so get to your enemy do your attacks put it away and then go in for your next strike so again going to jump straight into fighting Lagombi here just show you a few of the sort of moves show you kind of some of them in action and then um, sort of go from there so as you can see I run into the enemy um, and also uh, obviously try and time it so that I can get my full three hits in um, and then afterwards I'll always roll out because after you land the third goal swing you are left um, vulnerable for a few minutes or sorry a few minutes a few seconds um, so afterwards ro rolling out is definitely your best bet um, and then other than that whenever you can try and get some charge hits in because that does do a lot of damage but you don't really want to be running around with charge too much because it does deplete your stamina bar so if you have no stamina then it will make you automatically use the move and if you're running then it will result in you doing the whirlwind move which means you'll be left even more open so you want to avoid doing that right so that was just a quick overview for the hammer um, hopefully if you're new to the game and that's sort of giving you a quick overview and a sort of quick idea of some of the basics you can use um, but other than that thanks for watching don't forget to like and share the video it does really help me out and obviously don't forget to subscribe um, and also don't forget to check out the other the other videos as well because if you want to try out some of the new weapons then I've got videos covering those so if you want some tips on how to use them then check them out Anyway, thanks for watching, take it easy, catch you next time, peace out.